I, yeah, I will remind you. I'm now live on Instagram. Hi, everyone. And Shipra is joining us as we speak. So Shipra, I'm live. So you can now go on my profile and you'll see a circle around my name. And if you click that circle, then I can invite you. I see you. So I'm going to invite you and you should see an invitation on your screen on Instagram. Do you see that I'm inviting you on your phone? We're going to be interviewing today. Okay, that's it. And I'm going to be recording the session. Thanks for speaking with us. Okay, you'll have to turn on your sound. Is that better? Is that better? No. no. We have to turn it all the way down. Here we go. Is that better? Um... You're frozen on my Instagram, Joe. Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to try to Oh great. Lovely. Ooh. Frozen again. I don't know why. I can Yes, I can now. Mm. Great. And sorry. Uh, why is it not working? Uh, um, oh, I see. This should not work. And it's lying. <laughs> it's working. I know. It's working finally, but you keep, keep, I don't know, your face keeps freezing in the yeah. middle. So if it freezes, because, I'll, I'll yeah, let you because know. I'm trying to fix the tech at the same time. So when I'm fixing the tech, it freezes me. But oh, all good. Now, okay. So now I thought it was my side. Anyway. No, no, no. Okay. We're good. We're good. So oh, welcome. Good. Thank you for being here. I know it's late in London. Are you in London? You're in the yes, UK. Yes, I am. I am. Yes. It's not that late. No? Okay. I okay, stay up way later. <laughs> okay, great. great. Um, all right. So we're going to be talking about um, your path from self-doubt as an actress to trusting your instinct. And um, I'm going to be doing all the listening and you're going to be doing all the talking. So wow. what? <laughs> <laughs> That's a <okay>. change. Yeah. <laughs> Um, so no, I'm just kidding. But like, if you would, um, share with us, like, when did self doubt start and what did that feel like? It started, I would say during COVID times mm -hmm. when, you know, work was less as an actor and, uh, you know, there was, um, nothing to really train with or, you know, and I was getting some self tapes. Mm -hmm. But I was, you know, I, if I can talk about the, the doubt, the, there was, it felt like I was blocked mm -hmm. and I was always thinking about how to do a scene or how it should look, how it should go, mm -hmm. how it should flow, how, what I should do. Mm -hmm. And it was just so much. It was all up yeah. here and it was. That's a lot of shoulds. Yes, <laughs> exactly. Yeah. So that's when the doubt started and, you know, mm -hmm. there was, yeah, there was a lot of them. And it, it Why do you like think that started in COVID? Um, I think because there was a lot more self-tapes mm -hmm. and I 
yeah I had to direct myself kind of you know edit myself mm-hmm. look at myself mm-hmm. a lot more <laughs> yeah yeah then um, you know then the in person auditions mm-hmm. where you just turn up do what you do and leave you don't yeah. have to really yeah so i think i think that's when you know i started like oh no this is not this is not good enough this is you know i could i could do oh, better there <laughs> yeah 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 that's interesting i've never heard it this way before okay and then um is that why you decided to reset it was um you know it's so funny jo because i was i was doubting myself to the point that i was considering i was considering at that one point in my life i mean i was con- questioning whether i should carry on acting mm-hmm. carry on as, as an actor be- mm-hmm. not because the work was less but because i felt so blocked that i just felt i couldn't carry on just torturing myself like this yeah. i wanted to be an actor but it was so painful and and then i saw your videos on facebook and it wasn't the content so much i mean of course it was the content to an but the way you just were you the way you showed up the way you came across i, I don't know I'm just, okay. <laughs> <laughs> no if, yeah i mean you can i mean on the way yeah i mean it was like there was something there that i i i felt it, it hit me just inside i felt connected and i felt I want what she has. I want oh, wow. The the you know the I don't know it was just I don't know it was just like a you were so natural and you were so Well I okay I'll take the compliment <laughs> cuz it feels good and it's great for my ego and No 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 uh, it's not a compliment it's the truth. <laughs> okay yeah 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 but so I'll take it why not okay know? yeah and uh, at the same time maybe I want to re- what I want to reflect that m- may have hit home is the fact that i'm i'm only ever just saying it's already there there's nothing to do but undo the shit that's in the way but i'm not selling you that i'm a great teacher and when you put me in your pocket then you'll be great cuz i have the secret formula no i say the opposite i say there's no secret formula i don't know shit and what i do know however is you were born free then you got conditioned and now you're not free any- anymore so let's go backwards let's undo the conditioning and get your freedom back and i can uh say confidently or or with with um absolute um integrity that um that's all we do we we facilitate people to be be reborn back into their truth that's i guess that's what resonated that you knew your truth was free yeah. and that you knew that you could get it back you can, yeah cannot get it back with a method or with a technique where someone says hey i got this magicness that if you get my magic then you'll be magic just can't it doesn't mm-hmm. it's bullshit so probably that's what you resonated with and i'm glad that you resonated with it so how was it to reset <laughs> i uh, well if uh, i'll try to sum it up because i literally it, it was like i went from being externally focused to yeah. just being you know if i can mm-hmm. say that yeah. and i realized that just being was was way more um way if more. i can say way way more, way more. interesting yeah. way more surprising yeah. way more juicier as you said <laughs> i have i was just going to say juicy i have chills yeah, yeah. rather than just trying to control everything and looking at myself from the outside mm-hmm. i started just being with myself mm-hmm. and that freedom that it brought of not having to you know 
keep looking at myself and keep judging myself and keep criticizing myself. It was, I was, it was just so freeing. It was, yeah. <laughs> I, I felt more connected within, mm -hmm. I would say. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Great. So um, was it at moments challenging to reset? Of course. Oh. <laughs> I, is that <laughs> Just went backwards, like hell, yeah. <laughs> there were moments, challenging moments, of course. <laughs> but I realized that I still realize that these are the moments mm -hmm. that actually matter. We need those moments to grow because, as you said, we've been conditioned otherwise so much that we need to be shaken a bit, <laughs> to actually look inside, keep, keep yeah. being reminded of that. Mm -hmm. And uh, I did hate you sometimes. I, no, you shared that I think, very <laughs> authentically with me. And, uh, and many people do, and that's fine. That's part, of the, part of the journey is like, you're completely allowed to dislike me. I know, and that was, that was so, so refreshing, mm -hmm. my God. I mean, I, it was, I mean, yeah, almost, I, I, I would say everything about it was mm -hmm. so refreshing and it mm -hmm. was just at, at every point I would feel like I've hit a wall yeah. and then I'd get through it, you know, mm -hmm. with the exercises that, that we did and with, you know, the coaching that we, that you did and I'd somehow find and navigate and wriggle my through, way through it. Mm -hmm. And then I'd realize, wow, I, I, I needed that. Mm, wonderful. You've been very brave in this entire <laughs> journey. Yeah, you've been showing up with the challenges, not faking it, not minimizing your truth. You've been, you've been badass, vulnerable, <laughs> broken, rebirthed. You've, you've, you've been alive. It's you literally alive. been, thank you. <laughs> thank you. It's literally been like, uh, yeah, it's literally been like rebirth because if I can share, I mean, I, I, earlier I only had told you, but I used to take anxiety pills. I remember you said that. And I stopped taking them mm -hmm. after the reset. Mm -hmm. And, you know, it set a ball rolling. Then I found, you know, other things that really aligned with this work as well mm -hmm. and took me further inside. And, and it's not that I don't get anxious anymore. It's just that I know that I need to feel it to, to go yeah. through it. You're not afraid of feeling anymore. Yeah. Exactly. Wonderful. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, thank you, Shipra. I'm so glad that you bumped into this, that, um, you know, whatever was orchestrated in the perfect way for us to cross paths and for you to be brave enough to get hit on the ground, get back up, get hit on the ground, get back I know. <laughs> up. And to really completely be transparent about your process and not trying to look good or do it right. You've just no. been shipwrecked this entire time. And yeah. you've, you've gone from self-doubt to trusting your instinct and being yourself, which is the only thing that you could possibly bring to the rest of the world is your truth, your beautiful, messy truth. We all we are all beautifully messy, vulnerable and powerful, all of it. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I'm realizing more and more that's, that's what's being human is all about. Yeah. So yeah. thanks, Joe. Thanks Thank for you. helping me come back to myself. Yeah. Thank you. My pleasure. My pleasure. There's <laughs> nothing else that I love doing. When I help people come back to their true self, it makes me come back with my true self and stay there. So it's medicine on both sides. Thank I'm you. sure. I can imagine. Right. So um, if anyone is watching this and it's making sense and you're having all the doubt and you're relating to Shepra's experience, make sure you connect with us. You can send us a, a comment or a DM. You can write reset and then we'll, we can send you some information. We can send you a link and we can connect. All right. <laughs> well, thank you so much, Shipra, for sharing yourself, your experience with vulnerability. Thanks, Joe. It's beautiful. Thank you. And I'll see you soon. Thank you.
Bye. Bye.